I have that look on my face, so you know what that means. Fan fictions. Um, I'm on Wattpad, which is another popular site for fan fictions. It's also for like original stories too. Um, there's a couple actual writers, like published writers, that have either started here or they've you know, started working on an original story or something, and they, they're on here. I, I've seen a number of published authors post stuff on here, actually. Um, I have an account. Um, I don't use it, really. Uh, I don't have a need to use it. I kind of just, anything I write lately, like my Nano Remo, I'll either post it to archive of our own, or I will post it somewhere privately, which is what I'm doing for Nano this year. Um... I'm just gonna go on a first impression because I was scrolling, I just scrolled really fast through some of the, like, pictures and the titles. And those alone are just, just a lot. So I'm just gonna scroll through the fanfiction category and just give a first impression of what I think, one, what I think about just from the title and I think they give a summary if you if you like hover, okay, it doesn't do that. I thought it did. I thought if you hovered it, like gives you. Well, we're just gonna look at the the cover arts and the titles. Um, right off the bat, <laughs> right off the bat, there's three Harry Styles fan fictions. I do not understand the hype behind One Direction. I do not understand the hype behind the fan fictions, even though I do know the After series was a very popular One Direction fanfic. Whatever. I don't... I don't understand the hype. I'm just gonna keep scrolling. Uh, this one, BTS. I don't know what that is. I've heard that a lot lately on my Insta... or not my Instagram, my Twitter. Uh, Imagines or... I, I know I've been or I like, I've been on this site before and I've read some stuff. Um, Imagines are very popular, I know. But Imagines for Joker? Uh, sounds cringeworthy. Um, this one looks like a Harry Potter. Oh, it says right there, Harry Potter. And it's a winner of an award? Or was up for an award? Uh, art looks really cool. I'm, I would read that probably. I don't know what that is. I, those look like the girls from that one group with that one song, which is not descriptive. Eh. This looks ultra cringeworthy. I'm so sorry to whoever wrote this and anybody who enjoys it, because apparently a lot of people have read it and enjoyed it. But it looks a little cringeworthy to me. It's Justin Bieber. It says baby girl. That looks a little cringeworthy. I do not want anything to do with that. Um, another freaking whatchamacallit, doctor. What? He ain't no doctor. He does not look like a doctor. More One Direction. This one says fan. That's Dan and Phil, I think. I don't, I don't really know anything about Dan and Phil. I was recently told, though, by a friend that I have a haircut like one of them, and I look similar to one of them in a picture, and I was like, I don't know who they are. She showed me, and I was like, oh, that's weird. <laughs> Um, wait, Yuri on Ice, that's that anime that's really popular right now. Another Dan, that's probably Dan from Dan and Phil. I don't know. Yo, what up? I don't know what that is. I don't recognize a lot of these. That's definitely Yuri on Ice. Mystic Messenger. I've heard of this. I think this is a game or something. I don't know what this is, but that looks adorable. Essentially, the point of this is for me to hopefully find something that looks either so ultra cringy or sounds so good and then is actually cringy and then maybe look, skim through it and see what happens. The One Direction stuff will probably make me cringe the most, though. I'm thinking. Just from scrolling. Uh, God, Penguin!
doing? LH. I don't know what LH means, but Club Penguin is a kid's game. Why are you making a fan fiction about it? Oh, this looks terrifying. No, thank you. Hey, that's the two kids from whatchamacallit. The uh, Oran. Oran High School. What the hell? Is this a thing? Am I that out of touch that I don't understand that there's... Is there a whole thing for Undertale? Oh my gosh, hold on. Let me just look this up. Undertale. Oh no! This is a thing! Oh no! I mean, good on you if you like Undertale and you want to write fan fictions and stuff about it, but oh no. I don't think, uh, I don't think I could even bear to read one of those. I don't read fan fictions anymore as much as I used to. Oh, look, the guy Sam. Oh. I don't read fan fictions as much as I used to, so a lot of this is just like, it's almost like a system shock to me. Like, oh my gosh. Fan fiction used to be so underground, now it's like everywhere. Oh my gosh. Oh no, there's fan fictions about this dude. <laughs> None of these even look like some of these, like the the covers look really pretty, but I know if you click it, it's gonna be cringy as hell. Again, if you like these, good on ya. But, wow, I cannot read fan fictions anymore like I used to. Oh God, no. Oh boy. I think I have to stop. My face is physically hurting. Oh no. It's too cringy. Oh, it's too cringy. Oh, it's too cringy. Go back. No. Back to the Okay, it's not going back. Oh, there we go. Back to that. Oh. So cringy. I have been very out of touch. You know what? That was only what's hot. What is featured? Oh, these look pretty. Like this one right here? This looks really pretty. That looks like an actual book I might want to read. As does this one. But it's probably some sort of weird Captain Hook story. Yeah, some of these look, look okay. I wouldn't read them, but like... Okay, this sounds great. Trapped in Her Own Game by Kim... It's a Kim Kardashian fan fiction. Oh, that sounds great. Oh, boy. You know what? I'm gonna click on this one only because... A Wattpad featured story. What does it mean to be a detective with no cases to solve? Sherlock Holmes tries not to con Oh, I had to click it. It's a real book. Wait, is it a real book? I'm confused. I don't know. This actually sounds really good, though. Um, maybe there's good ones out there? I don't know. There, I know back in the day there was always that one good one and everything else was just, ugh. Ooh, the cringe is real. I can feel it right in here. Ooh. I'm gonna click this one too, just to, just because I want to know. I'm curious. 30 chapters, that's not bad. So it's a book about Captain Hook. Okay. And you know what? Let's, while we're at it, let's click Undiscovered. Mm. What 
the heck is that? What is it? <laughs> I am speechless at this point. The cringe is so strong. It is taking my speech away. I can see that Yuri on Ice is a very popular thing right now, apparently. And it is showing. Oh boy. Anyways. That's me reacting to Wattpad covers and titles. Um. Again, if you know any specific fan fictions, specific authors, fandoms, ships, leave them down in the comments and I'll go into one of these sites one day and just type that in and pick one and read. Um, I don't know what else to say. My face hurts from cringing. Oh. So anyways... Leave a thumbs up if you like this video, and remember to subscribe, because I make new content every day, and you don't want to miss it, or the cringe, and until then, I'll see you in the next one.